1989, my thoughts were short, my hair was long Caught somewhere between a boy and man She was 17 and she was far from in between It was summertime in northern Michigan Caledonia and uh, it's 4am and Brad and I are about to uh, take off. We're, um, I think we're driving a couple of hours. The language barrier is still quite challenging but uh, we're, we're doing okay and um, so we're driving for a couple of hours and hopefully uh, can get into some hunting. See you soon. Brad and I have walked probably eight, maybe ten kilometres. We've seen four deer. Everything's sort of been spooked. Um, we're hunting in some uh, real different country here. So uh, even when you sneak, you're still, um, still just spooking them, really. You make me believe even though I'm not right All of them have said those words before and now the tables turn there is no chance Well the stage
well, found their way back out to the track, which is good. Um, I'm sweating. Oh. Just dripping. It's probably about 26 degrees. Anyway, it's all part of the fun. Hunting rooster in New Caledonia. Right, it's Saturday here and uh, we've come to a, another new property and we're about to go out hunting. It's about five in the morning, so I'm just getting geared up. Um, yeah, yesterday we didn't do any good, but we uh, had, uh, had a good look around at this other block. It was really cool. We saw a few, we got onto a couple of stags that were roaring, which was pretty cool. So, uh, we're going to have a look at this new block now. As you can see, it's, um, it's pretty foggy. It's a, uh, a little hunt this morning, and um, we heard a gunshot, which is probably Brad and his crew, so hopefully they've shot something. But there's plenty of sign around, it's not quite the raw yet. It's a, uh, a good long stalk. There's a fair bit of sign around, but um, I'll, I'll uh, go and try another spot now. Very successful morning hunt. Absolutely stoked. Got him probably 15 minutes into the hunt, running across the bloody fire break. Good results. I'm discovering. Luck's got to be on your side. <laughs> yeah, there's a bit of that going on. You, you spot him, it's normally 100 miles an hour disappearing. So, very good. Very good for day two. Now let's go and get one for Jeremy. <laughs> yeah. Rest of the day. What is the right light? Ah, it's a uh, GoPro. Camera. Pro GoPro. It's the way. Because. No, I don't think. Stag, thanks to my good friends here in, in New Caledonia. We uh, hunted pretty hard this morning and um, we uh, come to another property and we're lucky to, uh, to have access here and I shot myself a uh, nice respectable trophy stag. So pretty happy, the old 7 room mag did the business. Now uh, we've got a bit of work to do, we're going to do some, uh, some head skinning and prepare the trophy to take it home. Cheers. This is my good friend Patrick from New Caledonia. We're um, hunting with him and uh, a lot of his friends, so we've uh, had a great time here. 
Brad was uh, very successful this morning. He shot himself a nice stag, which we'll see. And I was lucky enough to take this one here. Thank you, Patrick. Welcome to New Caveria. <laughs>
believe